Hello, and welcome to Sean's Test Bench. This is the sixth episode of Mail Time, so uh, let's get started. This is from Benutu, China. I think pretty much everything we get nowadays in America is from China. We don't really manufacture anything anymore. I got the package there. This is a Molex, 4-pin Molex to two 5-volt fan connectors and two 12-volt fan connectors. So you can change the speed depending on which one you put it on, whether it's 5-volt or 12-volt would be the speed of the fan. I need that for the Red Cross fire build. We have here uh, Ontario, California. These are four rubber feet, also for the Red Cross fire build. I didn't have any rubber feet, so I get these. They're non-marring. They won't mar a desk or uh, anything, and they got a little metal washer in them and a, and a hole through the back so that you can screw them on a case. And I want them small like that, so this, that's the ones I ordered. Okay, we have here... Kennersville, North Carolina. Okay, these are the fans I ordered for the uh, Red Cross fire. These uh, white blades will be painted red. I'm going to leave the frames black. These are uh, NZXT fans, 92 millimeter. Or 90 millimeter, I'm not sure, but uh, these come out of the Kraken. They're Kraken uh, GPU coolers, and uh, I guess whoever bought the GPU coolers uh, decided to go with Noctua fans instead of these. These are brand new; they were just removed and not used on the GPU cooler. So I purchased them. I got a good deal on them, and that's what's going to go in the thing. Now I should have another one too. I uh, Ordered three. There's three fans in that case, and then I want them all to match, so. Okay, where we got here? Well, it's written in Chinese, so I assume it's from China. Uh, Shizhuan, China. I believe that's pronounced right. Okay. I got this for my girlfriend. It's for her new Samsung Galaxy phone. Uh, it's her brand new, uh, it's the brand new Galaxy uh, Samsung. So uh, this will set on her end table, charge port plugs in it, and she just, uh, on her nightstand, she could just set her phone in it, and it'll stay charged. This really has nothing to do with computer stuff. So, All right, let's uh, keep going here. City of Inter Industry, California. Radian 120 gig SSD. Uh, this was from Newegg. Uh, Usually comes on a new egg box. It must have been from a seller on New Egg. Uh, this is also for the Red Cross bar. This is a brand new Radian, AMD Radian R3 series solid state drive. This will go in the Red Cross bar along with a one terabyte uh, Seagate drive. This is from China, of course. Gan Gulendun. I don't even know how to pronounce it. Uh, I'm sure if I was Chinese, I'd be able to. This is uh, vinyl. It's supposed to be four inches by five feet of vinyl. Uh, I got a new toy I'll show you here in a minute. Uh, but uh, it was 99 cents. I couldn't pass it up even though I had to come all the way from China. It is 5 foot by 4 inches. So I can do quite a bit of lettering out of that. It's silver. And it says a brushed aluminum. I don't know if you can see it. In the camera. But it has a brushed aluminum texture to it. It's supposed to mimic brushed aluminum. So uh, for 99 cents I couldn't pass it up. Uh, it took a little while to get here. 
but uh, that's it. So let's uh, grab one of these boxes here. We are from, I can't even see this when they printed the label so small. Tampa, Florida. Just above uh, Orlando and all that, or it's on the west coast of Florida. And this appears to be another NZXT Kraken 92mm by 25mm fan. There's the Kraken G10. It's a GPU cooler. Uh, and I just bought the fan. Uh, like I said, they, the same gentleman sold this to me. Uh, they take the stock fan out. I mean, they're good fans, but they're not really the quietest fan. And then they, they usually purchase a Noctua fan that are extremely silent fans. They're expensive, but silent. So, uh, there's all three fans for the Red Crossfire. As I said before, these blades will be painted red. The frames will be left black, and so it'll match the theme of the Red Crossfire. So, no one's come back and at me here. Uh... Discount Laptop Parts, Castleberry, Florida. I don't recall ordering laptop parts, but it um, could be. And we have a processor here. I can't really read it. I need to get glasses. Um, this is not a laptop processor, so this is an AMD A10 6800K. This is a AMD APU, and uh, the K means it's unlocked, it can be overclocked. Uh, I, I really don't overclock stuff, but um, I'm sure some of the people that buy my products or my computers, they overclock. So this is a A10 processor, and this will go into a another build. I don't really have one, but... Uh, I'm sure I've seen a good deal on it and decided to get it. Birmingham, Alabama. And we have another process. AMD Sempron. This is a AMD Sempron 3850 quad core processor. This is for the AM1 platform. Uh, for the AMD's AM1 socket. So, let's see, let's take a look at it here. They taped it up. So, you get the processor, manual, and look at the tiny little fans, huh? Uh, they're making things a lot smaller nowadays. This is actually a very good uh, processor for a home theater or just a general desktop computer. Uh, it really wouldn't be for gaming or any you know, video rendering or anything that's uh, CPU really intensive. Uh, but uh, as for a general desktop, it, it makes a really good processor. So, let's continue on. We're getting into the bigger packages here. likely from California or China. Uh, we have red vinyl. Some red vinyl film. This was uh, purchased also for the red crossfire. It's a little bright. Uh, I'll see how it looks in, in a darker case. But they actually included a nice little pink razor knife. And a uh, application uh, squeegee, I guess you'd call it. It's for uh, applying vinyl. So that was nice that they added that extra in there. But, uh, Lacona, New Hampshire. Laconia, New Hampshire. MSI, AM1, I. This is a micro 
This is a mini ITX motherboard. This processor fits this board. I was uh, planning on doing a build and I bought an Intel motherboard and a Core i3 processor for that build. And the problem I came across was Intel's motherboard is blue. The actual PCB board uh, is actually blue in color. Uh, the build I was planning is black. So uh, I didn't feel that the blue Intel board would match very well with the theme. So I picked up this Mini ITX MSI. Uh, it has M.SATA, dot SATA, a Mini SAT PCI uh, slot. It uh, yeah, it's just a basic uh, Mini ITX board. We have HDMI, VGA, and uh, DVI. Uh, outputs on it. It's a USB 3, the new USB 3, so uh, yeah, and that, that processor fits this board and it will uh, that's where it's going to end up living one day is right there on that board. Okay. Olympia Fields, Illinois. Asus M59A, which is not in there. Another motherboard. This is a full-size ATX motherboard. This is an MSI. And uh, it says right on there, it's a FM2A85XA-G43. As you can see, it has about every connection you'd want on the back on the I.O. ports. This is a full-size uh, ATX motherboard. That A10 processor, which is right here, fits that board. So that's why this was purchased. Um, I had plans for a build that I needed a a larger board. I, I didn't want to use a micro, I, uh, excuse me, mini ITX or micro ATX. I wanted a full-size ATX board for this build. And that is why these two items were purchased. So, uh, well, that, that was quick. Uh, let me uh, show you my new toy. This is my new toy. That is what this vinyl was purchased for. I have more vinyl coming, different colors and different sizes. But this is a Circuit, I'm sorry, Cricut Expressions. It's a vinyl cutter plotter. Uh, I'll be able to hook this to the computer and cut out decals of which I would I need for uh, PC builds. I had a really hard time finding anybody to do decals for me. They want so much money to cut me custom decals, it just wouldn't be feasible. Uh, when they want $50 to cut me a couple decals, it just defeats the whole purpose of doing budget PCs. Uh, I can't put $100 in decals in a, in a computer and expect to get any of that out of it. So... This was my solution. So, this came from Craigslist. I got a really good deal on it. I think it was 60 bucks. Uh, these are $2.99 at uh, Pack of Tans right now at the, at the craft store. So, I got a really good deal. It came with all a lot of extra cartridges and just a lot of extras came with it. So, this will be something I got to learn how to use. Well, that wraps it up for this mail time. Uh, stay tuned. And if you like these videos, leave a comment. Ask me to do more of them. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Have a good day.